second half of the Consolation Cup is now starting. And we are ready to go after a great battle of endurance. We are now ready for the most technical, or arguably most technical race we have thus far. Hello everyone and welcome to the JBL Consolation Cup Season 3 Event 5 The Water Ski. This is a 1v1 event where every single team sends three of their members down into a water park course. Well, the goal is to have the, all of their members down to the end the fastest. The team that does it faster will keep moving on into the next round until we will only have two teams racing at the end for the gold. We're now hearing the, of course, seeing a demonstration as the team at the bottom got all of their members finishing first. That means they would win and move on. But now we're starting the actual match. Speed Star Skeletons and Banana Blasters get us underway for the first heat of the first round. And Speed Star Skeletons get stuck. Speed Star Skeletons stuck on the course. Banana Blasters pretty much just have to finish, which they do with relative ease. Did the Speed Star Skeletons free themselves? Yes, they did, but it's too little, too late. They will be eliminated. A big mistake here in the, the second sector. You can see them getting stuck on each other. And unfortunately, that means they will be out of this event. Banana Blasters, without a lot of struggle, with relative ease, are moving on. Easy advancement to the quarterfinals. Banana Blasters, they win the heat. Let's find out who will win heat number two and face off against Banana Blasters. As we will scroll back up to the top of the course, Sugar Crush and Maple Leaves getting underway. Down into the first second, Sugar Crush a bit in the back, but can they bring it back? One of their members actually got stuck near the top. Can Maple Leaves keep it together? Yes, they can. Maple Leaves will be moving on. It was a relatively close race for the most part, but unfortunately the one Sugar Crush member that got stuck right um, just a moment here is what cost Sugar Crush the win, or at least a potential win. Who knows, maybe they could have done it, but it doesn't seem likely. As regardless of that, it's the Maple Leaves who win, and they are moving on. Maple Leaves to the quarterfinals. Sugar Crush are going home. At the very least for this event, Sky Hydrators and 13 Colonies are the next ones down the course. Sky Hydrators and 13 Colonies both missed medals yet. They don't have one each. Can they get one here? Maybe, of course, one of them has to get it. And this was a very, very close match. I believe the Sky Hydrators may have had it just barely. You can see them being very close to one another. No one really breaking away, a bit of a mistake here from the Sky Hydrators, but we managed to bring it back. Who won it? It is the Sky Hydrators. Sky Hydrators just been a bit more clean down the course, and that is good enough to get them through. I'm Axolotl and Furious Fireworks up next. What do they have for us? Furious Fireworks sounding much better. The Lime Axolot is struggling to get the final member going. Furious Fireworks down the course. Can they win it? Yes, they can. An easy victory here for the Furious Fireworks. Not really a lot of trouble here. An easy, easy win. And they need this. Furious Fireworks currently struggling quite a lot in the standings. A decent showing in the last event, but they need more points. And here they are, just a few points on the board here. At the very least, a top half finish. I'm Axolotls, can't say the same thing. We are out of this event. As we are ready to keep going. We have already seen, I believe, half the teams are now ready for the other half. Laser beams and sapphire spirals getting us underway for heat number five. Struggling a bit to enter the second sector. So far, it's the sapphire spirals a bit further ahead. Can we keep it? Oh, laser beams coming in quickly. But I believe not quick enough. Not quick enough from the laser beams. And I believe the sapphire spirals have done enough. That will be advancement for them for the quarterfinals. Again, another team that desperately needs points. They haven't done much yet. But they could get something done here. Let's see down the course. No mistakes made. It is advancement. For the Sapphire Spirals, good enough of a job to move on. 
next speeding trains and the spices. Two teams who have shown potential so far in this season. First time I ever been able to say this about the speeding trains, but they are currently trailing behind and did not manage to mount a comeback. Spices, who held the lead, will be on top this time around and move on to the quarterfinals. Speeding trains are unfortunately out of this event. They didn't have it in them to move on again, and unfortunately, that is a bottom half finish for the speeding trains. Let's see if their second half can uh, give them just as well of an ending as the first. So far, not a good start. But let's see, we still have a few more matches to go. Gamma Rays and Pyromaniacs up next. First and second in the last event. Gamma Rays, in fact, with two back-to-back -back gold medals. They would love to get a third. This would be a JBL record. As we get to see it, and it could happen as they do win this heat. Gamma Rays managed to beat the Pyromaniacs and progress once more to the next round. They are now up to the quarterfinals and beating the Pyromaniacs once more as the Pyromaniacs will unfortunately be out of this event. They will not have any further advancements, but at the very least they are on the trade they are going up currently. Let's see if they can continue doing this. Let's see. But first up, who will face Gamma Rays? Between, once again, Valdivians and Brightening Napweed. And Brightening Napweed stuck right at the start, but we managed to bring it back just a bit, only to get stuck again. Brightening Napweed in all kinds of mess so far. Valdivians just trying to keep it together and do. They will win and move on. Brightening Napweed, it's just not their season so far. They yet to have a good showing presented for the team and the fans. So far, uh, an easy advancement once more for Valdivians. Brighton and Gnapweed, are they just giving them easy progression? It's a thing to keep in mind. They're supposed to be rivals, not friends. But so far, Valdivians are doing well. And Brighton and Gnapweed, not so much. As we are done with the first round, Speedstar Skeletons the worst time by... Quite a bit. We'll get zero points. But who will move on to the final four? Oh, Banana Blasters oh, and Maple Leaves up first. And so far, it is looking like the Banana Blasters as the Maple Leaves final member is struggling quite far behind. Has to catch up. Can it do it? No, it cannot. I do not believe it was good enough. Pretty close. But I don't believe that was fast enough. Let's see. You can see here. Uh, treading from behind. So far. Trying to bring it back. I believe Banana Blasters were just a bit more efficient near the end. Yes, they were. And that is a win. Banana Blasters. To the semis. Would love to get a back-to-back -back medal. That would be very nice for the team. They've been struggling for the start. We can bring it back here as the Sky Hydrators and Furious Fireworks are up next. And Sky Hydrators have one of their members stuck near the top. That's not a good look. It looks like an easy win here for, this, for the Furious Fireworks who also get one of their members stuck. Oh wait, the Sky Hydrator final member did manage to make it through. And because of it, because one of the Furious Fireworks members got stuck, somehow the Sky Hydrators win the match. Sky Hydrators, by some miracle, are off to the semi-finals. One of the worst times I've ever seen, but everyone has finished. Because you can see here, right at the end, right on the wheel, one of the Furious Fireworks members got stuck. And unfortunately, because they never finished, Sky Hydrators had more finishers, and they will win the heat. Sky Hydrators to the semis against Banana Blasters. Who will be in the other semi-finals? Spices and Sapphire Spirals Sapphire starting us off. Spirals. Sapphire Spirals currently a bit further ahead. Uh, as it would seem, I believe Spices may have lost one of their members, if I'm not mistaken. But as have the Sapphire Spirals, what's gonna happen? Oh, they both lost one, in fact. Oh, so it's about time. Never mind. So now it's a matter of who finished first between the remaining two members. Because both teams have lost one of their members on the track. It's a matter of who finished faster. And so far it seems to be, at the very least to me, that the Spices have done better. And they have. Spices 
once more. A bit lucky, but we are moving on. Spices to the semis. But who will they face off between Valdivians and Gamma Rays? Gamma Rays with the greatest momentum I've seen from a team in a while. They would love the advancements once more and are currently in the lead. Can they keep it together? Yes, they can. No mistakes made whatsoever here from the Gamma Rays. Valdivians just a bit slower and that cost them. Sometimes it's just that little bit of more efficiency that can make the difference and this time that's all it was. Gamma Rays will be moving on again and are potentially two matches away from a third gold in a row. A win for the Gamma Rays, Valdivians are eliminated. As we have officially closed on everything except the top four, we are ready to start the semi-finals. Sky Hydrators and Banana Blasters get us underway to start the semi-finals. So far, Banana Blasters with a better start. They would love another top finish here. Looking good so far and they will make the finals. Sky Hydrators a bit shaky, a bit slow. And they are out and will be in the match for a bronze medal. Banana Blasters into the finals. Another podium finish for the Banana Blasters and potentially a gold medal. Something they haven't had in a very long time. It's been since the very beginning of the Consolation Cup back in season one. Can they get it? Maybe, we're gonna have to wait and see. But first up, who will face off against them in the finals? We have to wait and see as it's between Spices and Gamma Rays. Two teams that are very good in those races of 1v1s. The finalists last time around in the wave race. So far, I believe the spices have the lead. Can we keep it? Oh, maybe it's a bit unclear. Wait, where did we go? We have only two finishers for the gamma rays, one finisher for spices. What happened? Spices have lost this match simply because gamma rays has more finishers. But what happened to the spices? see here two of them moving forward only one escaping one still moving here oh and they just both get stuck on the wheel one member of the gamma rays get stuck there but two spices members get stuck so that means that gamma rays will win and they will be moving on for the gold medal match potentially for a third in a row spices and sky hydrators will go first of course for the bronze medal match Wow, Gamma Rays could do it again. Who knows what will happen so far. It's a close match here. Spices in the Sky Hydrators. And it was a very, very close finish between the two for the bronze. This is a six-point swing. Of course, you can either gain three more or lose three more, depending on how well you do. So this is an important match. You can see here that the lead being traded back and forth between the two. Sometimes it's the Sky Hydrators, sometimes the Spices. But who took it in the end? Oh, it's the Spices just barely. Spices doing just enough. They will take the bronze today. Sky Hydrators, no medal in this event. As on to the finals, Gamma Rays and Banana Blasters. Banana Blasters falling behind. One of their members stuck in the back. Is the free row on the cards? It is coming up so far. We're going to the final one, and it is. And it is. One of the Banana Blasters members was stuck, but that did not matter at all. As Gamma Rays, with a JBL record, the first ever back-to-back-to-back -back -back gold medalists. And I believe with this may also tie the Marble Sports record for three in a row. I don't believe a four has happened yet. Regardless, they're happy on top. They were already in the lead, and now they extended some more. Gamma Rays. With the gold, Banana Blasters will get silver, Spices will take the bronze. Good event for all three of the teams, we will all have a great turn showing here. Gamma Ray is obviously still in first, but now the gap widens some more. 30 points up in first, they're already in event clear. It could potentially guarantee qualification in the next event, the Sandbox. We hope to see you all then. Till then, don't forget to keep 